Welcome back to IAS Tech. In this video, we will see how to use Angular Material cards. We will cover multiple use cases. For example, we will see how to create a basic card using Angular Material. Then we will uh, see how to implement cards with action alignments and of and we will also add card with the footer and in that footer we will add the progress bar as well and we will also see how to add a card with multiple sections avatar and an image and at the last we will see how to uh, add cards with different media sizes so let's begin so this is the project that i have this is a very basic project the empty shell right now in this project we will have to import some modules for example we need to import mat card module we have to import it first angular material slash card <coughs> mat card module now we will add it into the imports array of the angular material once it is done we can now go ahead and uh, start using it i will just add the mat card component here and you will see uh, let me add some text so you can see that uh, this is a very basic angle material card you can change the style for example for example you can change the width of this card <coughs> so this is uh, the very basic example how you can add a basic angular material card next we will see uh, how to add actions and align them so <clears throat> for that i will just press enter and add mat act card actions and here you can add the buttons uh, to add buttons we need to import another module from the angular material that would be mat button mat button module okay now as we have imported the angular material button in the app module so now that button is available to use in the app component.html just add it like this mat first of all you have to add a button then in the button you have to add a directive called mat raise button or whatever design you want submit and you can see we have added an action now we can add another button just to show you So we have a submit button and we have a cancel button and I can change the color of this button as well. And if you want to change the alignment of uh, these action button, you just have to add a, an attribute align and, and you will see that it is aligned to the right. Now, next I will show you how to add uh, these titles for that just uh, press enter here and add a tag mat card title and here you can add a title welcome this is title after that you can also add mat card a uh, subtitle as well to add a small heading small title so this is a subtitle next i will remove the height to see how it adjusts itself okay 
after that we will see how to uh, add a footer so to add a footer you just uh, add something like mat card footer and in the footer you can add anything for example I, I i added a sample text it is looking like this you can add a progress bar as well to add a angular material progress bar you have to import it first and for that i will import it from the import statement and now add it in the import array now we can use it to use progress bar and net progress bar and we have to add a mode mode would be indeterminate there are multiple modes that you can see from the documentation but for now we will just use this one you can see that there's a progress bar or uh, that is showing in the photo section and in the next example we will see how to add images in this to add images we will add another uh, so first of all uh, we need to add an image uh, for the avatar but before that we uh, if you look at this uh, it is divided in multiple sections so first section is the header second one is the content and third one is the footer so we have to add those section for that add mat card header and move all of these things title and subtitle into the card header and now create another tag mat card content and uh, in the content we will add some content for example this is a co content okay and I can next we need to move uh, these button inside the footer and I will remove the progress bar okay so these buttons are in the footer but uh, uh, it is touching to the boundaries so i will add some padding i need a padding to the right so i will add padding right okay and next we need to add an avatar image like this one for that i will add an image tag source and in the source i will copy this and uh, path okay this is how it is looking right now but i will change it uh, i will add an a, a directive on it that would be mat card avatar okay after adding this uh, directive it uh, has changed its shape and next we need to add this image to add that image you just uh, copy the image tag and uh, go to the mat card content section and add this and now type mat card image that would add the image and uh, we don't need avatar okay it has added the image properly uh, let me try to add another image yeah so i also want some padding uh, below the title so i can just go up and add margin bottom so this is not working instead of that i can add padding bottom So we have a padding so you can add text inside of this we have a content uh, next 
we will see how to add uh, image uh, with different sizes that is also very easy for that i will just copy paste these cards to show you multiple options so this is a, uh, a this is a, a simple image uh, this is a simple card and uh, in other cards i will show you different variations about the image sizes so for example i will add another tag that would be mat card title group and i will move everything about title inside of it and inside of it i will add this image as well no it is not, not looking good i will so i think maybe we don't need the title group right now i can remove it and uh, just uh, we need to change the size of this image and uh, to do that you need to add card image so these are the all of the options you can these are the sizes for the media this is for the large image for medium for small and for extra large so let's try everyone one by one so this is large size and i will copy paste this card i copied and pasted different okay so here <clears throat> we have medium size actually let's remove all other cards for now so that i can easily show you to because uh, these are too many cards and going out of the screen so i will just remove the extra cards and show you one by one so this is the mat card medium size this is the large size and uh, this is the small size and this is the extra large size okay these are the all sizes that you can use so i think that's all uh, you want to know about uh, uh the cards that's it if you want to read more about it you can just go to the documentation of the angular material and you can read uh, about further options if you want but uh, this is all uh, we mostly do in about the angular material cards in the real project so i think uh, uh, this would be helpful helpful for you thank you for watching my video see you later bye